Okay, here is what Jesse just found in our very own backyard. A bee swarm. I think we're going to collect some bees. Let's get set up. You know, I kind of thought the water would make them fly more, but apparently not. Because I don't want to get away from it quite soon, but... No, don't break my tree. To get too close because I don't want to get stung. I'm not in a bee suit. He's just brushing them into the box. He's got like a special bee brush. You can see him flying around. It's not too dramatic. Let's see if I can get closer. seem to be walking in. <laughs> Chaos, go away.
Okay, it appears that most of the bees are making their way into the hive. They're just a little bit unsure at this stage. And once it goes dark, I'll come back and I probably won't be able to film this only because it's going to be dark. I'm going to plug those holes up there with some paper towels just so the bees can't come out and get lost. And I'm going to close those bottom vents up, which are, you can open and close. I'm going to close those up and plug up those holes to just keep all the bees in. And then I'm going to relocate this whole hive to its new spot where it's going to live for the next few weeks. Now once the hive is in its new spot, I will come back and open everything up. And then hopefully the bees will realise where their new home is. But I'll be filming that part in the morning anyway. Now I was going to relocate the hive last night, but I have decided against doing that. And the reason for that was because there were still a lot of bees on the outside of the hive. And if you relocate the hive with a lot of bees on the outside, obviously those bees don't know where the hive has gone the next morning. So I've decided instead to just get a chair, strap the actual hive to the chair to get it off the ground. As you can see here, the bees seem to have accepted their new home. So what I'll be doing is I'll be leaving the hive there for a few days till everything settles down and then I will relocate the hive to its new home. So I might end the video here and I'll do another video on how to relocate the hive. I'd just like to remind everyone that's watching this video to remember that this is not the only way to do it and I'm only just learning. This is all part of me learning to be a beekeeper. Now if you've got any questions please leave a comment down below. I'll try and answer all questions to the best of my ability. If you enjoyed this video don't forget to give me a thumbs up and smash the subscribe button for more bee related videos from Mike's Man Cave. Thanks for watching and bye for now.